I mean, they have a kind of a wide range of receivers. Duvernay's fast, they got height, they got a lot of different things. How tough is this wide receiver quarter cover? Man, they're they're really physical. You know, they're all like what six six, six five, and six four. And there's I don't think there's anybody shorter than that besides Duvernay, and he's he's a different breed. You know, so they're they're all pretty physical. So it's going to be really really tough trying to you know trying to maintain and uh, do what we're supposed to do just because of how physical and how big their bodies are. So we got to really bring our A game this game. Did you ever run against Duvernay in track? No, I haven't. I, I never ran against Duvernay in track. Would it be fair to say this is the type of game that you guys build up to? Uh, yeah, this is yeah. This is a this is a real big game, and it's a it's if we want to turn it on, this is this is the game to, <clears throat> to turn it on, you know, because it's it's OU Texas big rivalry game. Uh, I mean, it's like wow, this is the, this is really where we're gonna figure out who we really are right here. Yeah, is is it though? Just as far as I think, there's a lot of people probably outside the program that say you know nothing's changed with this defense. It, this could be a statement game for you. Yeah, this, so. this could really be a statement. I mean, uh, that's what we're. Uh, that's where we're we're coming in. We're coming to uh, handle our business. You know what I'm saying. And uh, we're gonna let the results at the end of the game, you know, uh, dictate everything else. So, uh, but yeah, we're really fired up to uh, play this Texas team. Texas is really good. Um, has your conference? Uh, I'm sorry, non-conference schedule and the two conference games. Has that prepared you for how good Texas is? I mean, they've played some I mean, pretty good teams so far. Nah, not to you know discredit any other team. You know everybody's been pretty good. We play, but uh, Texas is like they're 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 the real deal. You know this is our really big first game. You know, uh, and now uh, we wouldn't want to have it any other way. And this is this is where we're gonna figure everything out. Trey, what, what's your favorite thing about playing in this game? <clears throat> In the Cotton Bowl and the fair, all that kind of stuff. Uh, really, really the atmosphere and um, man, it's like like I like I said before, this is really an emotional game for me. You know, uh, because um, through my freshman year, sophomore year, I was going through things with my mother, and uh, everything happened around all this time and stuff like that. So, I'm really excited to go out there and give everything, give my all for her and everything, and uh, just to make plays because I've showed up freshman year, sophomore year with something. You know, so uh, I'm ready. To, I'm really excited to go out there and make a play this year. What's your thoughts on Sam Ellinger? <clears throat> he's really, he's really a good, um, he's really a good uh, quarterback to me. For for me, for what I think, he's very physical, and uh, he can run the ball like he's a running back. So uh, you know, he's he's not one dimensional. He uh, he can run the ball, he can pass the ball. So we got to be prepared for that. What were your thoughts on Sam Ellinger in the Big Twelve Championship game last year when you sacked him in the end zone? <laughs> it's a, it's a, that, that was just a moment I was living in. I'm not living in that anymore. But uh, man, I. I don't, I don't know what to tell you. My thoughts was like, wow, I really sacked this guy. You know, he's 240 pounds, and I can't believe I brought him down. You know, and I'm 180 at the time. So, uh, but yeah, it's gonna be a new game, and I'm sure you know they're gonna they're gonna really try to target. Is that him. blitz in the book in the playbook just in case this year? I hope. <laughs> How much more difficult is it to get a guy down like that when you don't have that? full head of steam like you did on that play? Man, if I, let's say if I stopped running and, uh, I, you know, I let up a little bit, uh, I don't think I would have actually tackled the guy, you know, because he's, like I said, he was so big and he can just run out of anything. You know, I've seen him get out of things with guys who was way bigger than me. So, uh, man, if I, if I would have stopped, I don't think that play would have even exist. Trey, do you think the game and the rivalry holds more significance for guys like you who are from Oklahoma? <laughs> yeah, of course. You know, uh, OU Texas, you know, if it wasn't Oklahoma, it was Texas and stuff no. like that. So, you you that that's what you hear growing up. You hear OU Texas or you hear OSU and stuff like that. So this is a real big game to play in, and I'm excited. Do you have any particular memories watching games growing up? Any games that stand out in your mind? Yeah, of course. Um, the kickoff return that Alex Ross took back. I mean, um, what else? Uh, Demarco Murray running the ball. You know, it was it was it was a lot of uh, special moments that I've watched growing up, and now I get to play in and be in it. So many times throughout this uh, series, there's been a special teams play that has <clears throat> turned the game or moved momentum, changed momentum. Uh, is it exciting for you that you'll have the ball in your hands at some point when they kick off? Yeah, of course it's really exciting because I'm eager to really make a play in this game, uh, <clears throat> regardless what it is, if it's on defense, even if they put me on offense. You know, I'm, I want to make a difference in this game, and uh, I just want to make a play and kick off return. I'm going to try to do what I do best. And how close are you to breaking one, or how close are you getting one going? Um, we're, we're really close, you know. There's some little things that we gotta uh, that we gotta fix, but we're gonna get that done, and we, we're gonna see this year. I mean, this this week actually. <laughs>